Hi, I'm Robert Portalance. I'm from Sault Ste. Marie. I've been living here for the last 10 years. And uh, I like doing art because uh, it's fun to create, uh, to be spontaneous and to challenge yourself. So I find that the oils, which is what I work with, is very challenging because it's easy to make mistakes. You have to let go. You have to learn to just let go. And any art that you do, you look at it and you just have to you just start. And once you start, it will unfold itself. And the answers will come through that. You do your first steps, your second steps, and then you'll know your third steps, and then your fourth steps. And that's how I go with my art. Uh, I don't think about it too much. I just let the answers come to me as I go. So you need a little bit of um, discipline and spontaneous creativity. Mixed together is a lot of fun. This one here is an example of the Agawa Canyon. I call it Happy Valentine's Day because there's a heart in it and we have some nice colors in it and it's uh, joyful colors. They're very Valentine colors and I, I remember I did this uh, last year, February. So it was the time for that. Well, what brings me joy really is mixing the colors. I like to, you grab two colors, two different colors, and you can take half of one and half of another, put them together, and there you create there. And there's a lot of joy in that. And then you get to see that mixture, that creation there of that mixture. And to me, that is my thing. And then you have the creation. So you've created from this color and this color, you've created this color. And then you can grab another two colors and mix them and create another color. And then you can work with these two colors down here. And you can also mix those two and create another. And to me, that's very, it's a visual mathematical process. You have, like in here, there's all the same colors. They're all born with the mixture of similar colors that were in there. Good luck and don't give up. Practice, repeat, repeat. And even though you see other people's work that look great and you're like, oh my God, I'll never be able to do that. Well, maybe that's not your thing. Just let go of that. Maybe use some of their ideas and then learn to create your own.